It's nice of you to pick me up for the party, Junior. At least somebody cares about me. These kids today. I suppose he thinks once he's got me locked in a nursing home, I'll die faster. And then he won't have to drive me anywhere. Well, if his father was still alive, you can bet your boots he'd show more decency and respect for his mother. Well, my brother John was a man among men. He was a saint. Anyway, lots of things are different now from Johnny's in my day. What do you mean? I'm not free to run my business like I want. Oh, isn't that awful? Just this week, your son stuck his hand in, made it a hundred times more difficult for me. Plus, he thumbs his nose at New York. Oh, what are you gonna do? He's part of a whole generation. You remember the crazy hair? And the dope? Now it's fags in the military. Stop it, Junior. You're making me very upset. I don't like to, Olivia, but I'm all larger to all the time. And I'll tell you something else. Things are down, all across the board. A lot of friends of ours are complaining. We used to be recession-proof. No more. You can't blame it all on the Justice Department. Our friends say to me, Junior, why don't you take a larger hand in things? Something may have to be done, Livia, about Tony. I don't know. There they are. Hey, Ma, Uncle June. You're using mesquite. That makes the sausage taste peculiar. Hi, Grandma. Happy birthday, my big boy. <laughs> Carmela, my mother's here. Everybody, let's eat! I want to open my present first. Hey, Meadow, I'm not going to eat, are you? <laughs> 